hello everyone welcome back to my channel so um i decided today to clean my plants uh, something i should have already gotten to i figured i would come on here and record just to show you uh basically all i use is water lemon juice and i put a little splash of coconut oil in there just to get it on the rag it leaves a nice uh sheen behind and it doesn't cause any buildup but basically you can see i just Hold the plant to support it. You don't want to be too rough. I have broken leaves before. And then you want to just clean the top and the bottom of the leaf. This is one of my old baby wash cloths, um, but you can use any type of microfiber cloth. I've seen people who have those microfiber um, gloves for like manicures or something. And so they just dip their whole hand in the water and then just wipe it, the um, leaves down like that. But I do it this way and it works well. The benefits of cleaning your plants because as anything else in your house, they're going to collect dust and that blocks the pores in the leaf and you want them to be able to um, photosynthesize like they need to, you know, take in all of the nutrients from the light that you're giving them and all of that. So you want to keep them clean. Also, it just makes them look better. Um, sometimes if you're a person who also misses your plants like I do, you can end up with hard water stains. And so this is a good way to get that all cleaned off of there as well so that's why um i clean my plants Here you can see I switched a bit because these this is a Hoya um, Woyeti and they have those thin kind of um, creased leaves. So I'm just using some Q-tips again from my old baby supplies. Um, so you can just get in between each one of those and make sure they get cleaned up. Also, cleaning your plants is the perfect time to check them over. As you can see, I'm finding some dead leaves buried down in there which are breeding ground for like fungus gnats and other pests. So it's good to get that out of there. So as you're cleaning, you can give your plant that once over, you know, and get to get rid of anything that needs to be taken out. And also just to assess the overall health of your plant, um, which you don't always get to see when you're just glossing over, especially when you have a lot of plants. I think I'm up to, I'm going to count them, but I think I'm up to, I want to say maybe 120 so although i'm doing something to them every day they don't get the deep attention like this unless i'm cleaning them so that's why it's a good practice to to do 